What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to display the most popular WordPress posts into your site. It can be into a footer, into a sidebar, into some widget or into some page in order to share to your site visitors the most popular posts in order to engage traffic, gain a second link, a second click and make persons spend more time on your site reading your nice content. But before I can continue, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video and share this content with a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it helps us, because you bring daily videos about WordPress, SEO, plugins, optimizations and many many more topics, not just internet and our site's favorites. So let's get this started. Very first thing to do is navigate your WordPress dashboard, review the left side bar menus, hover mouse over plugins and click on add new plugin, okay? Once right here, we're gonna move to our WordPress dashboard. Review the upper right corner of our screen next. We're gonna type into the upper right corner of our screen next to the keyword into a field called search plugins popular posts. Just like this. And here we go. From actor. Click on install. After this, click into the activate button. You're gonna be redirected to the WordPress plugins list, a list where we can see all of the present plugins on your site, okay? And of course, you're going to be able to see the popular posts plugin right here. You can explore the plugin settings. Or we can move to our WordPress left sidebar of menus, over a mouse over settings and explore the WordPress popular posts. Here is a dashboard. We have some tools. The full thumbnail, in the case that I want, can be the featured image or not. We can apply lazy load or not. We can empty image cache or not. And there is other very useful fields right here. Okay, for example, the data, log limit, and some miscellaneous. Okay, open link as current window, new window, use plugin style sheet, disable or enable for CSS, and enable experimental features. And of course, ex empty cache in the case that we need, okay? Now, how to make this work? We can make it work into our widget, into our sidebar, into our posts. Imagine that we would like to display this into a widget, so move to our WordPress dashboard, hover a mouse over appearance and click on widgets, for example. Or if you are using the full site editor team, you can go to any place that you want to customize your site. All we have to do is apply a block. In my case, I would like to display this into the right sidebar of my post, so I'm gonna click into this plus button to add a new block. Search for popular posts, find this block, click right here, wait a moment. First of all, we can apply a title, a limit for posts count, short by total views, daily views or comments, okay, you can display this, you can filter this, time range, 24 hours, 7 days, 30 days, all time or custom maybe seven days. Display only posts published within the selected time range. No. Post types can be post, can be products, can be pages, can be portfolio posts, any custom post type that you wish. Post IDs to exclude. You can exclude some post ID. How to get a post ID? Go to our posts on your WordPress left side bar of menus. Click on posts. Hover our mouse over the post and if you review the URL that's gonna appear, you're gonna be able to find an ID. You can copy the ID from there, okay? Let me go back to the plugin. Outer IDs, categories, tags, category product cat, tag product tag, shipping, post settings, short and titles, display post accept, display post thumbnail. This is important, right? Maybe, maybe not, it's up to you, according to your design style. You can change the thumbnail sizes in the case of which, or use predefined size. Up to you. Now, sub tag settings. Display comments count, display views, display author, display date, display taxonomy. We can even use custom HTML markup in the case that you prefer. And we have some themes to customize the layout and style of this popular posts. Let me update.
Let me move to one of the posts to reveal the results we got. And here is the popular post example, okay? Most of our posts is on draft, so there is no much content right here, but of course you can customize to check. Maybe we can, for example, let me scroll it down. Display post accept can be twenty Looks like they need a little bit of time to update it on sidebars. No problem at all. So just wait a moment in order to see the final results we got. And we have other styles to play with. And that is, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. Don't forget to check out our Burless plugin to get widgets, elements, templates and tools to build up your site using Elementor or Gutenberg, or Enzu WordPress team, the best free WordPress team that you can start to customize your site in the way that you want, or growth.net platform, a place where you can promote your blog, by submitting it you can start receiving and publishing guest posts on our blog. And of course, in the case that you want to go premium while you're doing your site, Go to visualmoto.com, purchase the Visual Moto Pass, and unlock full access to our entire template library, with hundreds of pre-built type sites that you can import with a single click. In addition to premium icons, assets, blocks, themes, plugins, and many, many more features in order to create the site that you need. And that is, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I see you tomorrow. All the best!